So now I want to add some music to my PSA or to uh, my voiceover uh, to make things a little bit more interesting. So I'm going to zoom in a little bit and then I'm going to find a piece of music from my audio library. This could be um, the server, the multimedia lab, or it could also be your own personal collection. I recommend using music that is not easily identifiable. Some generic sounding sort of music so people don't get confused. Am I listening to a, a song on the radio or am I listening to a PSA? We want to make that easy to figure out. Okay, so I've got some music here. I've got some music over here and I can just drag that in to my session. Okay. We all put things off we know we should do. So things are obviously a little bit too loud, so I need to balance um, the music with the voiceover level. And I already recorded my voiceover at the optimal level, so what I need to make sure I do is just maybe alter the volume of the music. I can do that very easily by switching from waveform view to volume view. If you look over here on the left hand side underneath the record enable button, I'm in waveform view right now. But if I wanted to change that to volume view, I get this nifty little line that represents what the volume is at any given moment on that particular clip. So a typical thing to do with um, a production piece like this is to establish the music um, very quickly and then sort of drop the levels down so that it falls underneath uh, the voiceover. So if I select the grabber tool up here, I can actually make points on this line and alter the volume. So right where the voiceover comes in, I'll put a point and lower the volume a little bit there. And I don't want it to be too abrupt. I want there to be some sort of fade there. So let's listen to how that sounds. We all put things off we know we should do, especially fixing things around. So now that I've done that, I think not only could the fade could start a little bit sooner, it needs to happen a little bit faster. We all put things off we know we should do, especially fixing things around the house. All right, so now I've successfully um, altered the volume of my music to sort of give some space, some room for the voiceover performance.